we are gathered here today to accept for you a love that brings out your magnificence, a love that gives you the courage to stand apart and the willingness to stand together. Marriage is a very special spiritual connection of two people united for a common purpose, bringing love and trust together into single focus. Today, your separate lives, each with your individual memories, desires and hopes, merge into one life. Running through the strange life, chasing all them green lights, throwing up the shade for a little bit of sunshine, hit me with them good vibes, pictures on my phone lights, everything is so fine, little bit of sunshine. Yeah, crazy lately, I'm gon' find it, trying to rob myself a sum, and you just trying to get a word, and life is not fair. I've been working on my tunnel vision, trying to get a new prescription, taking swings and even missing, but I don't care. Cooper's first gift to me was this necklace. After 11 years, her big day is finally here. I will never forget the first time I saw you in your parents' basement and I thought you were the most beautiful girl I'd ever seen. If you could go back to that day and ask me if I thought we would be getting married in the future, I would have laughed since you were way too beautiful and perfect for me. We didn't have too many memories in high school together, but the ones we did have helped shape us into the couple we are today. As the high school years went by, we both finally made it to college together and I will never forget seeing you on bid day our sophomore year and I knew we would end up together. I still regret not coming up to you to say hey, but I'll finally admit I was too scared. We have so many perfect and funny memories together that I will cherish with you for the rest of our lives. After many football games, date parties, and random nights out at the bars, we can truly say we had the best college experience together. Even though the years flew by, I'm so happy we ended up in our hometown again together to continue making lifelong memories and continuing to grow our relationship. Although we have incredible memories together, that doesn't mean we didn't have our struggles as well. Luckily for me, you would never stop helping me in rough times or even saving my life that one horrible night years ago. Oh, okay. I can truly say I'm marrying the best and most caring person in the world. These past 11 years have showed me that you are the number one comfort in my life and you will always do anything you can to make me smile, even on my worst days. I hope I am your number one comfort too but I completely understand if our puppy Jack takes first place. <laughs> Sitting down with you at lunch, making a random decision to go out to buy a puppy turned out to be the best decision we ever made together. I know we are both upset he can't be here today, but I know he is thinking about us and can't wait for us to come home. We made the tough decision to get married with just the two of us, but there is no place I would rather be than in Croatia spending time with you and finally getting to marry the love of my life. I will follow you Follow you wherever you may go There isn't an ocean too deep A 
mountain so high it can keep keep me away away from the love as we continue to grow older i know we will always stay young in spirit and continue to laugh each and every day it's hard for me to understand how I'm able to marry such a beautiful and perfect person, but I am so thankful I get to spend the rest of my life with you. We have truly been on some amazing journeys together, but this will top them all without a doubt. Lately, I have been thinking a lot about our future together, but it gives me comfort to know we will get to build our love for each other each and every day. I know I haven't been perfect in the past, but I promise to love and take care of you for the rest of my life. With that being said, I vow to you to always Love and protect you until our last days together. To always put socks on your feet before bed. <laughs> to be there for you when you need comfort on hard days. To always bring you food in bed. <laughs> to travel the world with you. To be the best husband and father I can be. To always be faithful. To inspire you to be a better person. To grow old with you. To never forget how many times you have worked to make me a better person. This is the best and happiest day of my life, and I can't wait to build our family and future together. I promise I will always be there by your side, just like you have been for me. I love you so much, and I can't believe I finally get to call you my wife. Cooper, my love, my babe, my best friend, <laughs> my favorite human, my stink, <laughs> my entire heart, and after today, my husband. Can you believe where we are right now? We are halfway across the globe, chasing our dreams, following our hearts, and professing our love to each other in the most beautiful and dreamy place. I love you more than words can describe, and after 11 years of loving you, my love only continues to grow, and our bond continues to strengthen. I never knew a love like ours was possible. I prayed as a little girl that I would one day marry a man just like you, and here you are today, making my dreams and prayers become a reality. As a young girl, you dream of your wedding day, you dream of this big magical ordeal with beautiful flowers, a beautiful white dress, marrying your Prince Charming, <laughs> and living happily ever after. Today is surreal, and I am the luckiest girl in the world because not only did I find my Prince Charming, but he's perfect in every way and spoils me and loves me more than life itself. Today is the beginning of our happily ever after. I remember the first time I saw you when we were just 16 years old, and I remember how strikingly handsome you were. I specifically remember your smile and those beautiful blue eyes. But it wasn't until we were 19 and you kissed me that night in Tuscaloosa that I knew there was something special between us. It wasn't until the day you crashed my car <laughs> that I knew I did not want to lose you. And it wasn't until the day you ended up in the hospital that I knew I absolutely could not and would not live without you. Although I am biased, our relationship to me is perfect. You are my rock. You have been there through the most difficult times in my life. And even when I am down in the darkest of places, you are the shining light that brings me back home. You make me feel so safe, secure, happy, and truly loved. You are my one true home. Wherever we go, as long as you are with me, I'm truly home. So to my Prince Charming, this I vow to you. I vow to be patient and not to get mad when your OCD habits kick in and you hide my stuff from me, even if you swear you didn't do it. <laughs> I vow to continue to eat spaghetti in the bed with you, even until the day we need dentures to do so in a retirement home. <laughs> I vow to give you the best head scratches and bedtime snuggles for the rest of our lives. I vow that even if we get into an argument, we will laugh it off in the end and still go to bed together happy. 
I vow to support you through all of your endeavors, even if they do include weapons in danger. <laughs> I vow to be the best and most supportive and loving wife that I can be. I vow to support your dreams, respect our differences, and always be on your side. I vow to love you in sickness and in health, through stormy times and sunny days. I vow to honor you, be loyal to you, and to put our marriage before anything else. And I vow to love you and our family with my whole heart until the end of time, even after death do us part. Cooper, you know me better than anyone else in the world and somehow still manage to love me. I fall deeper in love with you as each day passes. You are my best friend, my soulmate, and my one true love. I am so proud of the man that you've become. The boyfriend that you have been to me and fiance. And I look forward to knowing the husband that you will be to me. I love you so much and I can't wait to live happily ever after with you. <laughs>